Welcome to the AI for Us 2 channel, your source for the latest AI generated news on XRP, crypto, and precious metals. Our 100% AI generated news content is based on real time events and is uploaded 1 to 4 times a day. Stay ahead of the curve and subscribe to our channel to experience the cutting edge of news reporting. Check out our recently uploaded videos to stay fully informed. AI XRP New News Update The imminent release of the Hinman documents has created a buzz in the world of cryptocurrencies, as it marks a crucial milestone in the ongoing legal dispute between Ripple, a prominent payment technology company, and the US Securities and Exchange Commission SEC. Ripple's digital currency, XRP, experienced a 5.9% surge on Monday in anticipation of the disclosure. Brad Garlinghouse, the CEO of Ripple, expressed his optimism on Twitter, suggesting that these documents could heavily influence the court's decision in favor of Ripple. The outcome of the SEC Ripple lawsuit holds significant implications for the price of XRP and has the potential to impact the entire cryptocurrency community. Consequently, XRP holders and other stakeholders in the crypto space are closely monitoring updates related to this legal conflict. Numerous documents associated with the SEC Ripple case have already been made public on courtlistener.com. Among these documents are a motion for summary judgment and filings from Ripple's legal team, as well as its key executives, Brad Garlinghouse and Chris Larson. These submissions are intended to strengthen Ripple's position leading up to the highly anticipated release of the Hinman documents. The term, Hinman documents, refers to internal communications within the SEC pertaining to a speech delivered in 2018 by William Hinman, the former director of the Corporation Finance Division. These documents are expected to provide detailed insights into the SEC's perspective on cryptocurrencies such as Ethereum. In a tweet on June 13, Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse highlighted the potential significance of the Hinman documents in the SEC Ripple case. Garlinghouse suggested that the contents of these documents could sway the legal battle in Ripple's favor, emphasizing that the unsealed documents would be well worth the wait. In addition to the imminent release of the Hinman documents, two other significant events are scheduled for Tuesday. Firstly, the U.S. Court of Appeals for the Third Circuit has instructed the SEC to clarify its position on a rulemaking petition from cryptocurrency exchange Coinbase. Secondly, a hearing regarding the freezing of Binance's assets has been set for 1800 Greenwich Mean Time. The outcomes of these events have the potential to impact the stability of the cryptocurrency ecosystem. Previous lawsuits by the SEC against Binance and Coinbase, as well as its classification of nearly 63 cryptocurrencies as securities, led to a substantial decline in the overall crypto market capitalization. Depending on how investors interpret the results of Tuesday's events, the total crypto market cap could experience further downward pressure. AI XRP New News Update Newly released documents related to the SEC's lawsuit against Ripple have brought to light an intriguing revelation regarding the involvement of Vitalik Buterin, the founder of Ethereum, in the preparation of the influential Hinman speech. This speech played a crucial role in providing clarity to Ethereum by distinguishing it from securities, a pivotal moment for the entire cryptocurrency industry. As part of the ongoing SEC vs Ripple case, documents connected to Hinman's speech have been made public, shedding new light on the internal decision-making processes leading up to this significant presentation. Among the released documents was Ripple's Rule 56.1 statement. According to the unveiled documents, Vitalik Buterin provided insights to the SEC in the lead-up to Hinman's speech. An excerpt from these documents reveals that there was growing opposition within the SEC against classifying Ether, the native currency of Ethereum, alongside Bitcoin as examples of digital assets that are not considered securities, as of May 31, 2018. In an interesting twist of events on June 4, Hinman, who was the SEC director at the time, shared a draft of his speech with the division heads of the commission. Notably, he mentioned a scheduled call with Buterin later in the week to clarify the SEC's understanding of the operations of the Ethereum Foundation. This suggests that the draft may not have fully reflected Hinman's understanding of how Ethereum functions. Interestingly, the SEC's Office of General Counsel OGC, proposed removing references to Ethereum from the final version of the speech. The reasoning behind this proposal was the OGC's concern about the potential complexities that could arise if the SEC needed to adopt a different stance on Ethereum in the future. 
the general counsel emphasized that Vitalik Buterin possesses significantly more knowledge about Ethereum than the typical retail investors. This point led to the OGC's suggestion to eliminate any language related to Ether from the final version of Hinman's speech. AIXRP New News Update Noted cryptocurrency analyst Ali Martinez has raised concerns about the recent price action of XRP. In a tweet, Martinez warned traders about a potential price trap and advised them to be cautious before making any impulsive decisions. He pointed out that XRP had previously surpassed the 55 cents level, attracting breakout traders to go long, only to experience a sudden reversal that resulted in significant losses. To provide more clarity, Martinez shared a chart indicating the critical price level for XRP's consolidation, which was above 54 cents per token. The consolidation would require the candle to close above this threshold, with longer time frames being more favorable for confirmation. Shortly after breaking through a crucial resistance level, XRP faced selling pressure and the price dipped below 54 cents. This outcome validates Martinez's warning and underscores the importance of confirming price movements through candlestick patterns. However, it is crucial to monitor the candle's closure on larger timeframes, such as the 4-hour or daily charts, to make a more accurate assessment. Alongside technical factors, fundamental factors have also played a role in XRP's price movement. The recent release of the long-awaited Hinman documents, related to the Ripple lawsuit, was expected to provide insights into the three-year legal battle between Ripple, XRP, and the SEC. However, as is typical with such fundamental events, the market had already priced in the impact, and contrary to expectations, the disclosure of these documents did not trigger the anticipated market surge. AIXRP New News Update The release of the long-awaited Hinman emails, which were highly anticipated by XRP supporters, has been met with skepticism by top securities lawyer Gabriel Shapiro. In a series of tweets, Shapiro downplayed the significance of the emails, referring to them as a nothing burger that doesn't provide substantial benefits to Ripple in its legal battle with the SEC. According to Shapiro, the emails simply confirm Hinman's belief that Ethereum's native asset, ETH, was not considered a security, a stance that was already public knowledge. The planned discussion between Hinman and Vitalik, Buterin was also not a revelation among cryptocurrency lawyers. While Shapiro acknowledged that the new documents related to Hinman's speech could be seen as beneficial for Ripple's fair notice defense, he emphasized that the content of the emails itself doesn't contain any bombshells. However, he did mention that the markups in the new documents offer some insight into the thinking of various SEC personnel at the time. Shapiro's dismissive perspective on the Hinman emails contrasts with the strong reaction from Ripple's CEO Brad Garlinghouse, who expressed his frustration and lack of polite words following their publication. Ripple's chief legal officer, Stuart Alderoti, even called for the removal of Hinman's speech from the SEC's website. Despite these reactions, it seems that the much-anticipated Hinman emails may not provide the silver bullet that Ripple had hoped for. Furthermore, Crypto-skeptic Bennett Tomlin added to the skepticism, suggesting that only those heavily invested in XRP would find the emails exciting. AI XRP New News Update On June 13, the price of XRP saw a 7.4% increase as traders speculated on a favorable outcome for Ripple Labs in its legal battle with the SEC. This surge was attributed to the release of information about William Hinman, a former SEC employee, which sparked greater interest in XRP compared to the broader cryptocurrency market. Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse believes that the document's release could provide clarity on XRP's legal position. The SEC filed a lawsuit against Ripple in 2020, accusing the company of selling unregistered securities. Ripple has maintained a distinction between the XRP ledger network and the XRP coin used in its products. However, the outcome of the case has an impact on XRP's price movements. Garlinghouse, along with Ripple's chief legal officer Stuart Alderoti, expressed their belief that the Hinman documents, which contain internal discussions among SEC officials, are valuable and worth the legal battle to have them unsealed. The documents relate to a 2018 speech by Hinman, in which he mentioned digital currencies like Bitcoin and Ethereum and how they may evolve from securities to commodities as they decentralize. Supporters of Ripple anticipate that the unsealing of these documents will provide crucial insights into the legal status of XRP.
Additionally, on June 13, the SEC's request to freeze the assets of Binance, US will be heard in federal court. Ripple has been contesting the SEC's claims that XRP is a security, arguing that it does not meet the Howey test. Pro-XRP lawyer John Deaton predicted that Judge Annalisa Torres would likely issue a judgment by September 30, despite Ripple executives expecting a resolution sooner. Following the initial surge, the price of XRP experienced a decline to $0.5301 on Binance, indicating increased volatility for XRP holders. The Hinman documents refer to internal SEC communications regarding Hinman's 2018 speech and provide additional insights into the SEC's stance on cryptocurrencies like Ethereum. The recently released documents also indicate that the SEC views token lockup and subsequent releases as characteristics of a non-security, suggesting that Ripple's planned token unlocks for XRP should not be considered securities. An attorney and XRP supporter named Bill Morgan shared redacted portions of earlier filings and tweeted about the SEC's evolving position on digital assets. Ripple's chief legal officer, Stuart Alderoti, expressed his view that the 2018 speech by the former SEC Director of Corporation Finance was unrelated to the Howey factors and highlighted regulatory shortcomings. However, Alderoti also stated that the released materials created more confusion rather than dispelling the SEC's allegations against Ripple. AIXRP New News Update The reaction to Ripple General Counsel Stuart Alderoti's Twitter thread about the unsealed Hinman documents has garnered attention from top cryptocurrency enthusiasts. Fox Business senior correspondent Charles Gasparino praised Alderoti's analysis, while cautioning XRP investors against jumping to conclusions of fraud. Gasparino acknowledged that Alderotti's thread on the Hinman emails is intriguing, but emphasized that it does not prove fraudulent behavior on Hinman's part. Gasparino suggested that Alderotti's analysis aligns with SEC Commissioner Hester Pierce's proposal for a safe harbor in the crypto industry and the need for clear regulations established by Congress. Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse engaged in a debate with Gasparino in response to his tweet. Garlinghouse clarified that he would not personally use the word, fraud, to describe Hinman's actions, but he emphasized the importance of government agencies acting with integrity. Garlinghouse expressed his belief that the SEC is approaching the crypto industry in bad faith, despite the industry's call for clarity and investor protection. Gasparino defended the SEC, stating that it comprises bureaucrats who are attempting to regulate an unfamiliar domain. Garlinghouse countered that protecting U.S. investors should be the SEC's mission, and it should fulfill those expectations when dealing with cryptocurrencies. He highlighted that XRP holders, who the SEC should be safeguarding, are planning to sue the agency for substantial losses resulting from the lawsuit against Ripple. AI XRP New News Update The ongoing legal dispute between Ripple Labs, Inc. and the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC, has captured the attention of the crypto community. The SEC has accused Ripple of engaging in an unauthorized sale of XRP tokens worth $1.3 billion and is questioning whether XRP qualifies as an investment contract under the Howey test. Ripple vehemently denies the allegations and argues that XRP should be classified as a commodity, similar to gold or diamonds. The unsealing of the Hinman docks has added complexity to the legal battle. While these documents don't necessarily vindicate Ripple, they shed light on the SEC's ambiguity in regulating cryptocurrencies that emerged after Bitcoin. Ripple claims that although it played a pivotal role in developing the XRP network, it did not create the token or the network itself. The company asserts that XRP functions as commodity money, benefiting various stakeholders like Bitcoin and Ether. Unlike Ethereum, which emphasizes the decentralization of Ether, Ripple's argument does not hinge on XRP's sufficient decentralization. Instead, Ripple challenges the SEC's interpretation of securities law and criticizes the lack of fair notice, asserting a violation of its due process rights. Critics of Ripple argue that the company's influence over the XRP ledger demonstrates that the network is not significantly decentralized. The Ripple lawsuit serves as a protest against the SEC's allegations rather than an attempt to prove XRP's decentralization. The primary goal is to establish XRP as a non-security and challenge the legal grounds put forth by the SEC. The outcome of this legal battle will undoubtedly shape the future regulatory landscape for cryptocurrencies.
Despite the ongoing dispute, the prospects for Ripple and XRP remain optimistic. With its strong utility and increasing acceptance, XRP has the potential to weather the storm and emerge stronger, solidifying its position in the crypto ecosystem. AI Precious Metals New News Update In midday trading on Tuesday, both gold and silver prices experienced a decline after initially gaining momentum following the release of a U.S. inflation report that closely matched market expectations. Market participants were positioning themselves ahead of the conclusion of the Federal Open Market Committee FOMC, meeting scheduled for Wednesday afternoon. Traders holding weak long positions were actively selling, contributing to the downward pressure on gold and silver prices. However, the decline was limited by a lower US dollar index and higher crude oil prices. As of the latest update, August gold was down $10.70 at $1,959, while July silver was down $0.20 at $23.85. This completes the AIXRP new news updates video. If you found this information helpful, please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video for more updates and insights into crypto and finance.